Hi, welcome back to Colts KRC. So, yes, I have already reviewed this and done a conclusion. We're going to do a final, final conclusion, if you like. And that's because I watched a video by someone else, um, an American person, or American people, and they said this thing had a three and a half minute flight time. Well, I can tell you that's absolute nonsense. I've reviewed this and got over ten minutes, and so has JD. He got over ten minutes flight time on it. In fact, I've flown it about three or four times now, and I've managed to get just over eleven minutes out of it. The reason I wanted to do a final kind of overview on it is that this, I flew this the other day and got over, just over 300 metres, about 302 metres before I lost their PV signal. And to me that's great for one of these drones, really is. The reason I wanted to do the final conclusion is I really do like this drone. I think, I didn't, I don't know if I said enough the last time of how well I think this thing flies. It had no really bad characteristics. The things on the app don't work great. I don't think they do. I don't think the all the other bits of follow mode and all the rest of it, the waypoints, I don't think they're particularly great. But for me, that's not really what this drone's about. This drone's about how well it flies and the camera is acceptable for the price point. It's expensive if you start buying it with two and three batteries. But if you just want the one battery pack, yeah, you've only got 11 minutes flight time, but just charge the battery. You can get this for just under 80 quid now. And I really do like it. It's unusual for me to come back and do another video on something like this, but I just wanted to do that. So I flew it again, uh, just outside again, because I didn't have time to go anywhere. So I so just fly outside again in less wind, and you can see it's, the video looks much more stable. There is jello on here. Let's not pretend there isn't, but it's a budget, cheap quad. And I think they're going in the right direction now. I think that. I'm not sure about this 2K and 4K business. I think let's get everything sorted on the drones, make them fly. This one flies really nice, and then we'll be too much. We will be a bit about the cameras, but I think that it's, they're definitely going in the right direction. So I just wanted to show you this. Uh, quick, do a quick one of it. I don't know if you'll have seen it yet, but I've got the EX3 coming on. I've already had it on by the time you watch this video from Eosheen, which looks very much like the F11 Pro. Uh, and then various ones and I've also got the Visio Zen K coming that we're going to do a review on and see what they're like but yeah this is good for me what the reason for this is just to post another video up so you can see it and see how nicely it flies and how the video looks in not as bad wind there's obviously movement and there's obviously jello but apart from that it's great thanks everyone for watching have a fantastic day
thanks for watching my channel if you like the video please subscribe and hit the like button and also hit that notification bell there's plenty more good stuff coming up